forget that day. Shut up, Norman. Hero of the hunt. No, you are not. The Guardia Cessna 365 now, 1500. We are heading for the hunt. Negative. Disregard that last transmission. Okay, you need to return to the Guardia. Negative, that was transmitted in error. Take your hand off the mic, Norman. We are going down. No, we are not. We can get a view. You want to try to land runway 13? Negative, everything's fine here. We're continuing as planned. That's it, Norman. I'm plugging out your intercom circuit breaker. Birds. What the deuce? Oh, shit balls. Oh, fuck her. Roger, where are you? Oh, I'm coming! Shut up, Norman. Shit. Stop the stopwatch. Uh, up we go. Oh! When you... Oh, he's having a baby. He's he's, he's lost. Just please rock him back and forth. So I have to start the whole shot again now. The whole thing all over again. And I said, right. Zero seven zero twenty knots. So I'm facing right into the window. New York helicopter terminal, and I can't remember the name of the fucking place, so now I have to go look it up. Hmm. Here we are in Manhattan heliport, and we're going to take off with this microlight. We're going to climb to the top of the building three times, come back, and then start stop the stopwatch. So, where's my stopwatch? Bollocks. I've lost an engine. I've hit, the, I've hit the right prop on the runway. Just go down, just touch it. There we go. I've got to try and stop this before the end. No, try not. Do or do not. Oh, thank God. Yoda, you are so wise. <sighs> Nothing more will I teach you today. At last, I'm going to steal an airplane. Yeah. How are you? You okay? Yeah, can I have a look around? You can. Can I help you? I need keys for assessors. There we go. Nice, simple start. In real life, when you're flying, you've got your life in your hands. So it's very, very important, obviously, to have the appropriate licensing, the appropriate training, including safety training, etc., etc. Whereas when you're at home in your flight simulator, there's no risk at all. Okay, she wouldn't even shake my hand at this point. It was going very, very badly, and I had probably made a fool of myself. But then it dawned on me the four magic words I have a jet. How long will you fly with this ship? Um, we'll go around Rick though a little bit. Oh no, but when we will change the plane? You know, for the private jet? What you told me? Champagne? Oh yeah, uh, I lied. Hello, everybody, and uh, today is a very, very special video. Uh, we're going to announce the winners of the shout out competition. This next channel is called Reaction Review, and I've got to say, uh, for an X-Plane channel, uh, this guy is putting in a lot of work. All right, I'm going to hit subscribe on his channel, and you should as well. <laughs> up again I'm way too high and I've got to do the whole shot all over again which is fucking fantastic recording sound no! where's rain where is King rain gone Bugger. this doesn't stop now I'll have to do this take all over again and I won't be happy I'll not be happy please stop please don't make me do this all over again it's late at night Please stop. We're driving it in a bit. Hold on, hold it up. Oh, I got one up. And now I have to do the whole shot all over again. 
Brilliant. Fantastic. Mmm. Yeah, nice. Yeah, nice. Floaty, floaty landing. That was not a floaty, floaty landing. And I'm way off the runway and I have to do the whole shot all over again. Brilliant. Just fantastic. That's just brilliant, that is. Okay, I can't seem to fly this at all. Oh, it's gone. It's gone. I've bust the gene in it. Um, okay, I don't feel very comfortable looking at this at all. I think we need something that can handle the force, the G-forces that are by I sense much fear in you. Oh, God, he's back. I shouldn't have said force. How embarrassing. You know, the aircraft kept coming apart because it couldn't take the G-force. <laughs> You'll be laughing when I get this down without the force, Yoda. You are reckless. Maybe, but look what I'm going to fly. Mm. Well, I'm too heavy. I need to drop those fuel tanks. Or two. See what you can do back there. <laughs> okay, it looks like it, I can just about keep it. Oh, Use the force. oh God, Obi Wan is here as well. Okay, it's looking good. It's looking good. Oh, bloody hell! Target. Of course now I'm doing floaty floaty. This is just not gonna do. Okay, I'm gonna have to take the flaps up and drop the lift. Go! Oh. Okay, 140 knots. Hopefully I'll stop by the end of the runway, but I'm not too sure. Now, that seems to have done it. So Yoda, what do you think? See through you, we can. That may be so, but the F A eighteen has a much higher G force tolerance. How can this be? It's G force, Yoda. Mm. Uh, it's nothing to do with your forces. Dangerous and disturbing. This Look, let, let's be quick about this. There's the dark side of the force, your side of the force, and G force. No. no. We may also have a G force, but nobody can find it. <laughs> Time for murder, death, kill. bombs will actually drop. I've highlighted it for you. Oh, it's Sam. Sam, Sam, Sam. How dare he interrupt my tutorial. Bombs away. This is the Heil gelungen, the front and breiter formation to besprechen. Im Süden hat der Gegner Zossen genommen und stößt auf Stahnsdorf vor. Mit dem Angriff Steiners wird das alles in Ordnung kommen. Mein Führer, Steiner. Steiner konnte nicht genügend Kräfte für einen Angriff massieren. Der Angriff Steiner ist nicht erfolgt. Das war ein Befehl! Der Angriff Steiner war ein Befehl! Niederträchtiger Treiner, der Feind! Feiglinge! Verreicht ein Verzager! Sie ist ohne Ehre! Sie wird ersaufen in ihrem eigenen Blut! Yes, I don't like trains particularly. I don't like them, I just don't like trains. Must be something to do with this freak. <gasps> oh, this is brilliant. Don't... Oh no! I didn't get the train itself. Cheeky bastard. If it's the last thing I do... Oh, brilliant, now my engine's dead. Okay, I'm going to do a kamikaze. I'm going to shoot the bejesus out of him, and I'm going to... I'm going to ram him. I'm going to ram him. I'm going to take the two of us out at the same time. You're going down, you bastard! Yes, I'm going to get you now! This is just humiliating. There we go, chopping all the power. Chopping all the power. Bollocks. Okay, it looks like we're gonna make it. Power off. It's gonna bounce really hard. Ooh, instead of a bounce. 
Bit of a bounce. Now, it's not over yet. I've got to steer the aircraft and then reverse thrust. I'm using asymmetrical thrust again just to steer it. No, go off the runway. I can't use reverses until I have it straight. Right, reverse. Oh, 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 voila! That's when, that's, that's what that looks like. Brilliant, fantastic. Oh yeah, now I've had power and it's crashed. Brilliant. That's you, whole thing, all over again. Fantastic, reverse thrust on. Yeah, brilliant, and that's what happens. That's, that's, that's what happens. Oh, I don't believe it. Why won't this work? Oh, it's gonna be a hard one. Now I have to do it all over again. It's got all the cameras. And yeah, this is, this is just fabulous. Okay, that's okay. Now, let it roll out. No, Yoda, I'm so embarrassed. I'm so mm. busy looking outside and ignore the instruments. Still looking to the horizon. Never hear that. I know, Yoda. All my attention was diverted to making a video. You did my word, not did you? I used reverse thrust with the props out of sync. I failed. The greatest teacher failure is... Oh, you're just peddling easy answers. Pass on what you have learned. I've done it. Success. Hooray! A bit of a bouncy bouncy there, but everything's fine. I've organized, it's all good. Okay, breaky, breaky, break. Oh, not too much breaking, not too much breaking. <laughs> I have it all under control. Nothing bad's going to happen. Everything's fine. Bucker. This brings new meaning to ski subs. Let's go. Everyone's dead anyway. The aircraft's heavier on the ground. So. Okay. Uh, okay. Um, let's let's just get it started up really, uh, really quickly, shall we? Let's just move on. Some miraculous miracle. I seem to have survived my egotistical madness. My legs badly damaged as I neglected to read and understand section 5 of the Cessna operating handbook, page 5 dash wood label performance. Perhaps I could crawl. Huh? Oh, God. you again, please. Oh, no. Is that you, Gentle Ben? Oh, thank God, Gentle Ben. As you all know, that was not Gentle Ben at all. It was another bear, and that didn't turn out too well. Greetings, everybody. Welcome to uh, another another Sunday of Crazy Madness uh, streaming in Microsoft Flight Simulator. And we are in Caledonia this week. Caledonia is... I, I didn't even... It's off the coast of Australia, folks. Well, it's not us. It's like... My, it's, a, it's far away from Australia, but it's, it's, in, the, it's in the Pacific... Yeah, a French place. Uh, I, I <laughs> you think, you know, it would be in, like, Canada somewhere. But this is the kind of a place that I wouldn't have thought of. But Colonel Clink did. So this is going to be an interesting flight. There will be some, there will be some flying around water. Uh, across the water, should I say. And, uh, yeah, so I hope you've all had a good week. I, lo I hope next week, uh, you know, this is, this is what we do during the week to forget about everything. So I'm hoping next week will be even better for you. Yes, uh, well, we're going to forget about everything now for the next two and a half odd hours. And, the, 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 you know, nothing bad is going to happen with regards to my flight today. Look at those graphics. Look at it. This is brilliant. 
There's everybody there. If I, if I declutter now, look. There's lots and lots of peeps with us. Many, many peeps. Let's see, uh, just very briefly, let's say hello to everyone who, who's showing up anyway in the tags. Uh, K. Johnson P's here. Baker Fly. No, not a lot. Falling up. Nighthawk. Uh, Marvin Biggins. Smurf 2. Ian got TNT. We'll be talking about... Is it Ian got TNT? Yes, it is. Ian got TNT. We'll be talking about something about Ian got TNT later. Your mama, if he doesn't mind. Windage, 31. Uh, and then there's a whole load of you bunched up there. I can't read it. But there's loads more of you there, I know. It only shows 25 at a time. So as we're in the cruise, as always, I'll be saying hello to everyone who's joined us. If you want to join us on the stream, uh, just look up for Gripper Sim uh, and Discord uh, and ask for an invite. If not, when we're in the cruise, I'll put a link in if the moderator doesn't. One of the moderators doesn't. First, uh, the flight plan has gone in there on Twitch. Thank you, Dav Davo. Uh, you also see the flight plan on the Discord and you'll also see it on the description of the video as well. That's where we're going and you can join us. If you send me a friend request, in Microsoft Flight Simulator itself, just do a search for Gripper Sim one word, and I'll accept that. Uh, so it's f it's for everybody, isn't it? So yeah, we've got lots of people here. There's Top Top Gun. Uh, we've got we've got our friend. Who is this? I can't see your tag. Can you hide your tag? He's flying the F twenty two. Yes, uh, waiting, waiting for everybody. Uh, the F twenty two folks, welcome the F twenty two. I bought that. It's Equus evolved. I bought that just so I can display the uh, the VF-35, sorry, that's the F-35, <clears throat> yeah, I know my airplanes, yeah, not all of them, obviously, so yeah, it looks like a, a nice kind of day here, some cloudage, uh, I'm using real world weather, I've changed the time, it's a bit early, uh, yeah, so we'll go along uh, and see how the time goes, and uh, we've got an interesting flight from Colonel Clink. Let's have a quick go with the comments. First of all, I've got to have a look at the Twitch comments. Uh, thank you, Davo. Put a put a put a thing for the link there for the for the, uh, the Discord. Actually, I'm going to copy that and put it on YouTube. So, oh come on, uh, I've got it on the screen here. So um, I'm going to put it on the YouTube here. So if you want to join us, um, let me do that. I have to open another window. Uh, copy. Sorry, I'm going to do a copy. It's all very live here, folks. It's all incredibly live, so when you see me looking over this way, you'll know that I'm looking at my second monitor doing stuff and things. There you go, that's in YouTube there now. You click on that, and that'll bring you straight to the Discord, uh, Discord invite. Every Sunday, 2100 hours, as always. Uh, every Sunday, I know I keep saying I'm going to stream and make more videos during the week, but things have been hectic for me lately, uh, as they are probably for everybody. But uh, yes, friend request, there we go. Can I accept it, Finn? Can I accept your friend request here without having to go to the main menu? Can I? I can. Yes, there you go, Finn. Welcome to the madness, Finn. Uh, you know, I won't get to them all as I'm flying, but I'm gonna just get this in there. There we go. Uh, but I'll, I'll do it, you know, after the show, straight away, as I always do. Oh, before. Uh, so I'm flying again. I'm flying again the Kodiak. Uh, yes, I'm going to fly the Kodiak again today. I like the Kodiak. Um, now, I've, I've, I've ordered another arm for the second camera because if you can see here where my hand is, I've got lots of stuff here. Loads of stuff going on here. Um, I paid for the real sim gear thing which you can't see me operating the auto autopilot. You just see my hand going up here. I'll move the mic a bit so you can... There we go. It's all here. So I'll have another camera is what I'm saying. Hopefully, hopefully next Sunday thing didn't arrive. That would be Colonel Kick. Uh, there is, there is, there is. Greetings, Colonel Clink. Greetings and salutations. And and the salutations. Yeah. Uh, great salutations this Sunday night. How we are? How how is everybody? It looks like it's very busy here. It is. It is very very busy. Yeah. Uh, we have. We have. I, I was just looking at that. I was just about to go to some of the comments, and let me just get my camera working here. Yeah, we've got. You know, it'll only. I think it's twenty-five at a time. It will show. Yeah. And then they alternate who we can see. So we've got quite a few here. It's going to be a busy flight. Yeah. Nothing bad is going to happen. Oh, it never is. Never is. No, not this week because I'm in, I'm making sure this week that it's just a normal flight. You know, uh, I've, I've got plenty of fuel. 
Oh, okay. Uh, and I can't remember what the ways. But yeah, plenty of fuel. Put that out. Uh, and all that kind of stuff. So, uh, you know, we're going over water. Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. Not too much. A bit of water. But we'll see. I haven't checked the fuel, but I'm sure there's plenty of fuel in, in the tanks. Yeah. Yeah. Plenty of fuel. Uh, oh, that went a little bit choppy there, folks. If it goes choppy when you're... Yeah, there is all that. You're doing choppy. Uh, sometimes if I activate... See, I've got two screens, okay? Yeah. So I've got the screen you can see, and i got the... the Streamlabs screen. So if I activate the Streamlabs screen, sometimes it gets a bit choppy. So you have a slow screen and a fast screen, and if you go on a low screen, on a slow screen, it gets choppy. It's an intermittent thing. Ah. It's fine now. Oh, okay. Fine now. So, will we not hold everybody up? Will I start my engines? Uh, you, you, you shall. You shall. I'll have a look at the comments and the stream. Yeah. Uh, Close the drawer. So we have the sand and we have. I love the sound. I uh, love the sound. 800 feet a minute, so that is good. One, and we we'll do the heading bit. Two. And mixture rich. We leave the mixture rich props fully forward. And uh, I'm not using the checklist because this is Sunday. I never use the checklist. See, it's not mixture rich, it's high idle and low idle. Yeah. <laughs> I know, I can't get out of uh, the old school. Die, you know. I'm just saying. You're, I'm you're just right. Saying. You're, you're high idle. I'm, I'm yeah, just you're saying. right. I know. I know. It's you like, are correct. You know, it's Do like correct me. Very actually. disappointing. Like, you know. Do correct me. I've never flown <laughs> one of these things that worked. High <laughs> idle. High idle. Max prop. You see, I've, I've changed my ways. Master on. Uh, I'll put all the bumps on. Uh, we won't start it yet. Let's put the alternators on. All the generators and stuff so don't forget later. Uh, and I'll follow the checklist as a set. Can I... Beacon on, landing light off, parking, parking, no, no, parking brake off. Oh, I need to label these buttons better. Oh, that's in the taxi light as well. Uh, I need to fix this. Excellent. Good. Um, strobe, we don't want those uh, off. Pedo heat, uh, we put that on. In fact, we switch that off. Make it more difficult. We leave the icing off. Oh, that's the avionic switch. Oops. Uh, okay, that's that done. Have I got fuel uh, switched on? No. So I'm going to switch on the fuel this time. There we go. Come on. There we go. And I think then we're going to kick it off. You know, you you also want to switch on the auxiliary bus, like, you know, just for good measures. Just for shits and giggles. Yeah. Switch on the auxiliary bus there. The, the auxiliary bus is next to the main bus, like you know. Yeah, let's pop those on. Let's get the camera ready for engine start. Boom. Uh, where's the auxiliary bus? Auxiliary bus. It's like yeah. you, you, you know where you have your master switch and the alternator with the battery. Oh, there the it is. There we go. Yeah. Gosh. No, that's not the auxiliary bus. That no, is that's, yeah, that's, 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 that's the auxiliary bus. Yeah. There's yeah, there's a there's about a three second gap. Oh. Uh from what your screen to mine, you see. I I, I thought you're doing real time. <laughs> yeah. There's a, th there's a three three second gap. That's a big outside. Yeah. Oh brilliant. Yeah, okay. three second gap or something like that. And there's nothing you can do about that gap unfortunately. No, I'm just messing. Very nice. Can't I can't you. Can I something? Wait. I just no, get rid of the brakes. Can anybody, can anybody remember what I've forgotten? Oh, it looks like it's... You switched the fuel on. Oh, this starts. It just takes a while. It's really well done. Yeah, the fuel's on. It's just really well done the way the engine starts. There we go. Engine has started. Let's double check that actually. Uh, yeah, that looks okay. Let's get the Garmin on. Hit enter to continue. Let's look at the engines. NG 21%. Yeah, okay. That looks good. No. Oh! <coughs> Everything's fine. I did nothing wrong. It's fine. 
Did you have the uh, uh, fuel uh, shut off while uh, closed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 just checking. Just, you know, I had, I, you know, it started now. Okay. It's very realistic how it doesn't start, is it? <laughs> <laughs> You're watching me. Damn you, sir. Damn your eyes, sir. <laughs> You've been watching. Of course. <laughs> that damn thing, the fuel, <laughs> shut up. To, um, uh, sorry, couldn't one. help it. It was well, too easy. Well, that's what you do to use a checklist, isn't it? <laughs> it's true, though. It's true in real world as well. Oh, that's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. Because I didn't use the checklist. Right. I'm just checking buttons. Isn't it? I'm angry at me. Yeah. Now, folks, so, yeah, I'm going to taxi slowly. Are you ready, Colonel Clink? Oh, yeah, I'm... I'm I'm, I'm sitting here on the uh, runway, um, waiting for um, you know you to show up and uh, hopefully take off. Yeah, it's giving me my baby wheels here. You see those blue lines, folks? Yeah. And I hope and I hope I my yoke doesn't give me any trouble today. It's like oh, yeah. definitely since the last update, there's some problems like where sometimes the yoke just disappears, and I believe it's a driver problem. But I don't think Logitech updated the driver yet. Yeah, it's very, very annoying, that is. I, I'm going to definitely use the whole runway. Because if I didn't, that would be foolish. And, you know, that's the opposite of what I mean. Yeah. Yeah, so I'm not going to use the whole runway, which is foolish. Uh, because what happens? You hit the trees at the end and you're, you know. Yeah. So. Uh, now I'm going to put the parking brake on. Brakes are loose, brakes are set. Full power. i will show you here. Look at all that wasted runway. And then we oh, go. Oh, that wasted. Uh, and, and let's see if I get above the trees. You know, that's what people do this all the time. All the time. Uh, and I'm making all the mistakes. I'm making people. all the mistakes Pe I can possibly muster, Mr. People never do that. Making mistakes. Oh, God, no. I've got my flaps down. And I waste loads of runway even more so. Full power. Uh, we've got the wind in our uh, favour. There, oh, there we are. Oh, I need lots of bright rudder here. Far too much than I would like to in a real aircraft. Flaps coming up. Happy days. Old oh, pilot oh, goes oh, on. I like it. I like it. I like the way it took off there. I like the way it little sideways motion from the wind. We have plenty of power. And then we go right on gears to nav. Oh, I didn't set my autopilot. I didn't set the autopilot. I just have to wing it. That's very foolish. I'll take a right turn. Uh, I want. I want. Um, no. I want to set my altitude. Setting my altitude. If you look here. If you look here. I have a little button here. And I set my altitude to. Oh, we go 1500 feet. And that's all I need. And autopilot is coming on. Oh, nice transition. Oh, I did set my vertical speed to feel good for some. No, yes, button. Come on, come on. Okay, let's just get this. Get my attitude. Come on, sit down. Uh, just connect to the other pilot. 1500 feet. There we go. 1500 feet. Autopilot active. I love the way you can see the fingerprints. Yeah. Uh, and it's going to turn and intercept. And I'll keep an eye on that. And we're up, folks. Flaps up. Do you think it up there? We did. So here we are. We're intercepting the uh, the GPS. And off we go. There's all the boys said there's got TNT. We're going to be talking about some of this stuff now shortly. Top Gun. There's uh, Edric's taken off. Steerman's taken off. ARH 64 CDN. Uh, Top Gun and a few more there are on the apron. Don't worry, boys, we'll catch up. Boys and girls. No, not a lot is ahead of me. And we're flying at 1500 feet. And there's the reef there already, Colonel Clink. Well, there's one of them. And one of those many reefs. It's, yeah. You can see the. over here. That kind of light. Let's see, let's go and have a look. Forgive me for taking you out. What I'm going to do is I'm going to disconnect follow the mode. And I'm going to accelerate the camera uh, to full speed. We'll have a quick look at this on our way out. Now, I've never examined the reefs before in Microsoft Flight Simulator. 
But that, sorry, I'm straightening the camera there. There you go. That's their interpretation. That's actually not bad. Uh, that is a satellite image there. Unfortunately, those way those are waves that were captured. Uh, the whitewash. That is a reef, folks. Uh, wow. Uh, oh, they've got a little bit of an error there, but yeah, that looks pretty cool. Um, I I I went diving in a reef in Australia off the the that was in 1989, and it was amazing. Uh, you know it was bizarre so much so that you've got your just keeping an eye on my flank here so much so uh, anyway it was a, a school I'll never forget it it was called Peter Tubbs Colonel Clank right yeah now diving is supposed to be fun yep this was like very aggressive hard ass macho training you had to swim loads. Uh, I was reasonably fit at the time, and I remember swimming. You had to swim tons and tons and tons in this big pool, and it was going on for half a day, and I was absolutely wrecked. So much so when I finished. Now, Colonel, think you you trained, you know, back in the past, right? Yeah. You you may tell me what this is. So I was so exhausted because I was determined to finish it that I got sick after. Uh huh. Because the I don't know, it's just exhaustion or something. But I did. Um, that, by the way, sorry to interrupt. That's Ak Linz21, who's just followed Ak. If I call you Ak for short, welcome to the madness. So anyway, Colonel Clink, that, that was tough. Uh, it was all very uh, tense. And yep. it was horrible. Right? Peter Tops. Uh, but anyway, uh, I, if you're ever going to dive, go, go to Paddy. Paddy is the way to go. But anyway, uh, I went diving in the end. And I remember putting snorkel in my face. Um, you know, not the snorkel, but the regulator. And you can't smile because the water comes through. And I was diving underneath about 10 meters. And I was like smiling. I couldn't believe it, it was just bizarre. It was so colorful. It was amazing, Colonel Clay. Uh, oh, no, I better believe it. I had run out of money. Uh, I knew I'd run out of money after that to get back to Sydney. Uh, but I said, I won't be here again, or it won't be here again one or the other so I'm glad I did it but the reefs are amazing if we get a chance highly recommend it oh no it's like any any anything like you know it's like you know be it like diving be it flying like you know for real like you know what I mean yeah if you've never done it just go for it like you know it's like it's just so amazing it's bloody brilliant mm. and you've done diving haven't you well yeah not not because like I wanted to at the time it was sort of a requirement oh yeah and it wasn't it wasn't like as beautiful as diving in reefs and all that sort of stuff it was more like confined dark spaces really yeah can you speak of this more uh, no interesting but uh, yeah, you learned in a pool and in difference, I, I never dived with a bottle. I only dived with rebreathers. Wow, a yeah. rebreather. And was it a big clunky thing or was no, it quite no, small? No, it's actually relatively small. Uh, it's like uh, the problem is like uh, if you don't have your weights right, it always drags you to, to the surface or tries to because uh, you have to blow air into it like you know so you get some buoyancy from it that's interesting yeah that is very interesting so but you can't talk you can't tell us anymore no okay Baranovsky <laughs> Baranovsky uh, let's have a look at the comments let us go to, uh, I just got loads of comments here, folks. Uh, I'm only looking at Twitch at the minute. How's everything today, Karen? Uh, Karen, everything's good today. Uh, good to have you back. I hope you're flying well. Um, I hope you're good. Johnny F's with us as well. Karen's talking to everybody. Uh, yeah, that there. They're all chatting about yourselves. Uh, DCS Ducks is here. Oh, DCS Ducks, I have to talk to you about that thing. 
it will happen because I want to fly DCS World uh, at some point. Uh, Goofy's with us as well. Uh, uh, flying mid D, flying mid mid G, mid G. Uh, what's the airfield, Goofy? Uh, Goofy, the, if you have looked at the flight plan down below, you see it. I think you got that though. Uh, windage is here. Uh, glad I'm appearing. Windage says it's a bit lonely on my screen. Yeah, it might take a while, depending on your internet connection. Uh, I bumped mine up quite considerably. I got the fastest I can get in Ireland, only because of, subs of subscribers. I use, you know, that's the only reason I have the, the real cool internet, the fast one, because I can stream that. Uh, da, 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 da. What's the recommended playing? Single engine, two eight or similar. I, I, I actually have a book <coughs> there on the Kodiak, like, you know, which I'm, I'm not I'm not happy with. You have the which? I have a book there with the Kodiak, which I'm not happy with, right? Hotel, hotel? Now, if you go on outside and you look at the um, the static wicks at the, at the uh, trailing edges of the wings, right? Yes, I noticed that, go on. They're not animated. They're yeah. always down. They're oh yeah, I see yeah. that the trailing edge there. It's, it's the. It's like. Yeah, good point. I wonder what that. That was the leading edge slats. Is it? No, no, no. It's, it's like when you're looking, when you're looking at the back, like you know, at the you have them on the ailerons and you have them on the elevator, right? Okay. And uh, they're just not animated. It's like, you know, it's like. This is terrible. <laughs> oh yeah, that's my complaints about the uh, Kodiak. <laughs> I just didn't hear that proper. What was? No, when you look at when you're looking at the uh, at the uh, trailing edge of your your wing, right where you have the static wings, right? There, yeah. are, there are two on either side on the ailerons, right? Like at the at the edge of it, right? Hang on, bear with me, just get the control again. Right. Okay. You see them there? Right. Oh, you mean the strips? Yeah, no, yeah, the, they are the, uh, uh, stat the static strips. Static strips, right. And they're not animated. Very, very disappointing. I get you. Sorry, I couldn't hear you. Okay, it's, I'll turn it back it's, on. It's very, very disappointing. Yeah, they should waggle a little bit, surely, shouldn't yeah. they? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, someone did that. Some developer did um, have that done. The uh, who did the uh, um, the uh, uh, PA 28s? Um, Coronado? Uh, no, not Coronado. Um, the other Just flight. Just flight. Yeah, they did that. Actually, funny enough. They did. That's who it was. Yeah. That's who it was. So. Uh, do you do you hear me, Kodiak people? You have work to do. <laughs> yeah. SW. Damn it, what was the name? Is, what was the name of them again? Uh, sim, 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 Simworks. 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 Yeah. So we've got a bit to go. We're flying along very quickly. Uh, let's have a look at the comments there on YouTube now. Um, let's go up to the Top. I'm just going to get relevant. Ian Pollard's with us. We're going to talk about something Ian Pollard has. Uh, um, I was going on a while ago about box of buttons, Colonel Clink. Yeah. And I think this is the very person who did that because I heard that I think it was from Frugal Sim. I think he was talking about them. Uh huh. And it was like, mm, let me just double check. Okay. Yeah, it's Ian. Um, he's the one who makes them. <laughs> oh, fantastic. And I remember looking for them and I never got the message. I never copped it because remember I went and got the real sim gear? Yeah. All I really wanted was the twiddly twitch buttons. Right? Just the buttons for the track and the heading and, and stuff like that. And uh, it looks like he's buttons, box of buttons that allows you to do just that. Because it was the dial I was looking for, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, I think it was, yeah. So we can have a look at that when we get into a better cruise we'll see now I'll get into it but anyway he's saying hello hello uh, hello hello and I was going on about the title I got the title wrong Barry Hoon's with us hello all he says hopefully my yoke problems are solved 
and I'll be able to keep up tonight. Oh, Barry Hoon's having the same problem. Barry Hoon's also a subscriber on YouTube. Yeah. Maybe the same thing as you kind of think. I know. It's 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 terrible. That's very frustrating. Sling 380's with us. Morning all. It's, it's especially yes. terrible when you want to land and all of a sudden your yoke decides not to yoke anymore. Oh, that's not good. Yeah. That's not good. Uh, what else do we have? We have uh, a vampire... Vampire Spicalala or something. <laughs> I really need to get back into Microsoft Flight Simulator again, he says. I haven't played it, uh, played it ever since I came, it came out. Oh, wow. So, uh, I'd just call you Vampire, is that okay? Because I can't get the rest of it. I know it's something very clever. Spiegel? Vampire Spiegel? Ooh, I'm about to crash into the mountains. Let us get our ratio. Climb. Let's go to the speed. This is good practice for moving quickly. Oh, climb up. Altitude select. 1800 feet, and we, uh, we are Looks like it's going to crash into a hill there. Um, uh, that's no yeah, good. so so vampire, you see what happens, to Colonel Kink, is when you're simming, you get into it and you leave it for ages, you know, and then you get back into it again with a vengeance, and then you leave it again, you come back in. So, welcome back anyway, vampire, is what I'm saying. Uh, Equus is with us, waves to everybody. Uh, Vampire says, your intro is great. <laughs> oh, good. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yes. Uh, you, you know, you got to have a timer countdown thingy. Uh, you know, I'm not going to hit that hill. Am I? I don't think so. Don't. Let's do the flight by. We're just skipping over the top of it. Oh, my plane has gone crazy. Oh, we're having problems. Okay. Uh, I'm having problems, Colonel Tank. Oh. I just fix these problems. Let us go higher. Let us go higher, folks. Um, to avoid any incidents. While this is... It's just going around in a circle. And it appears as though my flight plan may have... Oh, no, no. We're going to the airfield. We're just there now. It's the first one. N Whiskey Whiskey... Uh, sorry, November Whiskey Whiskey Sierra. I think that's the first one, Colonel Clink, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll confirm. Yes, it is. November. Whiskey, Whiskey Sierra. Yeah, okay, so that's why it's gone crazy. So, uh, you see, I'm chit chatting away, folks. Oh, now it's going south again. Okay, I have to come back and land. So, sorry, folks, I'm coming back, don't worry. I've done the same thing. All the product disconnected. Uh, let us get back to the airfield. You're probably all wondering what the deuce I'm doing. The usual, I'm not paying attention. Not paying attention, <laughs> you know. Not paying attention. I'm very bold. I'm very naughty. There it is. Oh, it's not showing it to me. It's not showing it on the flight plan. Okay, I'm going to have to cheat. It's going down. Car's going back. Oh, I love the way the clouds, it's like, kind of, it's just so cool. Uh, let us go overhead the runway. Let's just climb up a little bit. Let's get our head tracking organised. Oh yes, I, I didn't configure the, the sim to zoom in and out, I have to do that. Oh, Colonel Clink, how's your Toby getting on? Are you... Uh, are don't, you don't know, it's... I think it arrived there on the 10th, so I haven't heard anything since. Okay. Karen Clink's coming in for final. Uh, gonna declutter. Declutter. Let's try not to hit the tree which somebody planted at the edge of the runway. Coming in for a right downwind. No messing about. Speed just coming down, start to roll flaps. Roll flaps now. Coming in like a bat out of hell. I lose it in the turn. Looking for the runway. Oh, it's a grass runway, okay. Grass runway. Okay, 84 knots a bit too slow. Let's keep it above 85 if I can. Easy, easy peasy that is. Easy. 
Oh, this big tree at the beginning. Uh, no more final. I'm going to avoid the tree. Oh, someone went through the tree. Very bad. Power's off. Let's pick up our big packages that we shouldn't be carrying. <laughs> There's every park there. Uh, I got a pax taxi to the end of the runway through these guys. I'll come behind everybody. There we go. Everyone's found the Kodiak. Now, uh, interesting. There's there have not been a lot of new stuff out. No. Yes, sir. I haven't been looking. I haven't been keeping an eye on the news as much. Okay, flaps up. Uh, except for takeoff flaps. Let's bring it to a hold here. Oops, oops, let's disable the old camera there. Uh, park and brake. Oh, no. Park and brake on. Anyone else to come in? I think I'm Paddy last because I went flying past it. Everybody's down, it looks like, except for one just on final. Let's just have a look at him. Will I get the touchdown? Touchdown. Oh, not very good camera work. Excellent. Will we will we begin again, Colonel Clank? Absolutely. Okay, is everyone ready? Everyone line up. I'll wait for everyone this time. I'll wait a little bit. What to say you can't think? It's only manners. Do you nah. know? Nah. Uh, we've got a few. We've got one or two um, TBMs. We've got a King Air. Uh, mostly, though, it is Kodiaks. But you can fly anything you like. Okay, I'll be get going. I think they're waiting for me. Okay, folks. Uh, let's make sure I have only 10 flaps this time. It's amazing. When, when someone... Uh, turns with the light on or, and I can see it inside the cockpit the lights it's incredible okay that'll do and uh, everything should be fine and let's go so park and break off full power condition lever fully forward along with the props did you hear that kind of thing condition lever yeah the mixture. Airspeed's alive. And uh, hot top. Take tow. Here we go. Positive right. Gear's fixed. Lap is coming up. And let's turn around. Smooth out the old engines there. There we go. Set up the autopilot again to get back on track. Uh, I'm just turning a little bit over 30 degrees, which is very bold. Let's get my autopilot set up here. Okay, let's go up to let's get my vertical speed set. Oops. Vertical speed. I'm already at my altitude. I'm already at the altitude. Oh, 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 easy, easy. All the pilot on. There we go. And we're settled. We're good. Let's just zoom out of the map. Okay, I see. So we're going to go along the coast. And then inland to the other side. And then over the other side to the... 
my son of the coast. Uh, uh, so we're going from the west to the east, back to the west. Try, try not to miss the next airport. That will well, be it's very close. Yeah. Well, it's well, yeah, a couple of minutes. I, is it because it's an, an interesting, challenging? No, no, it's just an airfield, you know. All oh, right. So it's going to be something interesting, folks. Colonel Fink has prepared something for Gopher Sim once again. I wouldn't get you into trouble, would I now? Well, when you try your best. <laughs> Keep uh, it coming. Keep it coming. Uh, yeah. Keep it coming thick and fast, folks. Uh, the best flight planner of all the flight sim. The best flight sim uh, planner in Christendom. <laughs> uh, okay, so why is the bloody thing so slow? I took a power back. I'll take a little bit more power back, so I'm not going crazy. So 155 knots. Let go. Uh, now I'm waiting for a longer leg, so I think in the next leg we we'll talk about uh, the button box. So, this is my bench. I'm going to have to. Uh, I need that other camera active. I need to get time during the week. Uh, I have another Ooh. camera, folks, and it's bugging me because I can't show you the stuff I want to show you. But that doesn't matter, actually. Uh, but I have. I spend about 400 quid on the real sim gear buttons. Yep. Uh, there's a way around that, folks. If you want the twiddly knobs or any buttons, I'm going to look at that now shortly, and I'm going to make a video on it as well. You know, from one of our community is making hardware from Flight Simulator, don't you know? So one of our very uh, own community members is, is is making hardware for Flight yeah. Sim at a very good rate. I have to say, I was just looking at it. Uh, on the on the on, on eBay there today, and I don't know why I didn't cop it before. So yeah, oh, we're very quick. Right, we're there. We're there. Uh, After this one, then, folks, we talk about that. I know. Autopilot off. Taking power back. Slowing down. Re trimming. Just got the camera there. So we'll see what I'm doing. There we go. It does slow down very quick. Let me just check it out. Yeah, no, she she slows down fairly quick if you want to. Yeah, I like that. I do like that. There we go. When you see a flick like that, I'm actually activating the Toby. So when I turn my head, uh, it's like I'm looking at the cockpit. Now, while we're on approach here, and while I'm looking for the airfield, <laughs> any has the prices of uh, has the price of 3090s or now 3080s come down? As far as I know, not no. Really? Look at the reefs they are like on outside. That is fantastic. Let's see the look. look at all the different colours, folks. Oh, it's just incredible. Yes. So it should be at my left window now coming up. Where are you? Oh, looks like someone's already spotted it. Where are you? Oh, there it is. Oh, very interesting. That's an airfield. Who's to know? Who's to know, folks? I think it is. Uh, let's have a closer look. This is far as hiding it now. It doesn't look like a grass airfield, Colonel Fink. 
Just because the grass is green, huh? Maybe you've tricked us. I'm judging by my map here. Oh. Yeah, that's gonna be it. Checking my speed. 104. First stage of flaps down. Oh, everyone's going around. Everyone's going around. So far. I'm gonna take a tight turn in, at least the speed of the turn in. This is like, uh, let's just call this a military flight. <laughs> We're flying it like we stole it, folks. Coming in for 80 knots, I've decided. Maybe 70. I'm sure it's 570. on pedals. Going down to 70 now, I think. No oh, flaps. Going in. I can see a little line there. I'm guessing that's the centre. Come on. Come on. I'll give one chance to embarrass myself. Or I should have my percent. There we go. Hard landing. Oh, oh I bounced. I bounced. You know what they say. A good oh, landing big crash is a landing you can walk away from. <laughs> Yes, I made it. It wasn't particularly pretty. It wasn't pretty. Uh, let's get out. Let's let's hop out here. Um, you challenge me, Colonel? I think it's like I'm racing a race car here. Now I'm out of the way. Turning around. Stop. Park and brake on. Let's watch everybody else. Slow down my camera because it's going to wreck your head, folks. Slowing down, camera. There we go. There comes one in here. Uh, he's on the 208. Oh, he's got it down nice. He didn't bounce like me. And is he going to stop, though? Is he going to stop? No, he's going into the water. He's on to the water. Oh, what a bummer. That's, uh, he just, maybe he got away with it. I don't know. <laughs> Uh, here comes, uh, I'm not putting on the labels because I don't want to embarrass people, I think, you know, that's fair enough, isn't it? Here comes another one, I in the Kodiak this time. Don't, don't, uh, don't worry about it, I, I read my landing gear a wee bit as well. Oh, oh, firm, I bounce, you bounce, bounce, I did the same. And is he going to stop, is he going to stop, no, he's going he's to the water, oh, poor fella, he's got to the water, we're all going swimming, folks, today. Let's go for a swim. Here's another one. And bouncy, bouncy, bounce, bounce. <laughs> and he looks like he's gonna stop. Yes. Well done, whoever that is. Here's another one coming in here on the TPM. Oh, oh, he's putting on reverse thrust. He's jabbing on the brakes as best he can. And he made it. Oh, yeah. no. So we had, we had a few. <laughs> we had a few wet feet there. No. You see, the, 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 there's one thing to getting down, right? It's like you need less runway to, to, to land. land. But uh, you also have to get up again, folks. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah, you can hit the Y button, folks. And Oh, here's another one coming in. This is great. Uh, here's another one coming in. Is another one coming in? He may... Oh, 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 oh. Here he comes. He's coming over the beach here. And there he is. He's in a Kodiak. And he flared a little bit too much, a little too much back pressure on the stick there, and boom, down, he's, down he is. He's up again, he's up again, and he doesn't know what to do when he's putting the nose down, and a big crash, a crash, a crash. Oh, don't forget to go around, folks. That's the best option. Uh, here's a few coming in here, someone's coming in here. Here he is. And touchdown. He's in the TBM, jamming on the brakes. He's jamming on the brakes, and he's got the nose in the air for ages. Fine, that's the back. Put that nose down. Get the, the, the front. No, he's not, he's going. I can't talk quick enough. And into the sea. Just you got your feet wet there. I think. There, but I think that's all that happened there. Here comes another one in the Kodiak. <laughs> and he's he's jamming on the brakes. And he's hoping for the best. Skitty giddy, sippy sippy, slidey slidey. Uh, oh, he's going to make it. Well done. Whoever that was. Well done. Well done. I wonder, Colonel Tank, is it better that I don't put on the the labels? Then I can get cheeky and, and you know. Uh, it doesn't matter, I don't think so. Huh? It doesn't matter, I don't think so. I don't think so. 
Uh, well done, everybody. That was that's an interesting one. Like getting out is a problem. Well, yeah, it's like you know, whatever stretch of land you had to land, right now you have to use that stretch of land to take off. <laughs> yeah, it looks like Lee. I think it's Lee. The tag is kind of going up. The big jet. Uh, Lee 19N92 is in the uh, Airbus A380. Yeah, so will I go first then and try to take off? Because I want to watch everyone else take off. Do you know, you guys take off. Go, I want to watch it. Go, go on, I take off before you. So you get something to laugh at. Okay, fair enough. I'll deep closure here. Okay, let me... Um, Which set, side of the runway uh, are you on? On the opposite side of you. You're probably on the sensible side with the wind in your favour. Where's your tag? Where is... What color are you red currently? No, no, no. It's like um, it's sort of uh, white and gray and red. There you are. I have you. Okay. So you're in. Let me um, get ready here. All right, and it's like um, I shove folks out of the way as you do. All right. Yeah. So let me check my flaps. I want 20 flaps. Right. I have 20 flaps, happy days, prop is forward, power goes forward, brakes are loose, brakes are set, right? Okay. Okay. You. See you there now. So, full power and brakes are loose. There you go. Ah, you'll be fine. You get out of there easy. Well, easy. We hope so. Yeah, you get out of there easy. So, no 40 problem. knots, 50 knots. Easy. 60 knots, rotate, happy days. Oh. No problem at all. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Lower the nose. Oh, I, I got a big turn over. He's got a murder death kill, John Spartan. You know, you know what just happened? My, my, my yoke stopped working. Oh, of course. Yes, everyone. Oh, that's so obvious. Colonel King's yoke stopped working. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh, come on. We believe you. We, we believe you. Did it really? Yeah. Or is that just an excuse? No, it, it just stopped working and it was not high enough like to switch the autopilot on, if you get my drift. Yes, of course. We oh, I believe that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell. Well, I'm going to try it now. Right. I'm going to try it. Um, nothing bad's going to happen. Everything's going to be fine. Uh, park the brake off. I'm going to use the whole runway. The whole runway will be used. I have plenty of fuel. Oh, 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 don't go to the trees. Don't go to the trees. Uh, this is madness. Now, okay. Where? Mm, I'm in the wrong place. Okay. Rather than jumping around the place, folks, like an idiot, I'll just slew it in to save us all some bother. There we go, right? Now, uh, because I'm so responsible, um, I, I've, you know, um, I, I, I'd, I'd make sure my weight is okay. You know? Yeah, so I would do that much. Uh, That's definitely what I would do. Oh. I would make sure at least that uh, I have, you know, the weights all in order. Uh, and get that sorted out. Okay. So, yeah, uh, we're fine with weight. Uh, I'm going to do 10 flaps this time, can't think. Uh, and, and hope for the best. Full power, brakes are still on, props fully forward, conditioning lever fully forward, brakes off. I'm going to apply a little bit of back pressure. No, that just goes drag. Forward pressure. 30 knots. Oh, we're doing okay, but the rudders are all screwed up. 
40 knots. 50 knots. 60 knots. Very gentle rotation. Oh god. Go with that nose. Go with that nose. Okay, we seem to be. It's very. I got loads of right rudder in here, folks. Okay, I'm past the 19 knots now. I'm going to take uh, a left turn. Are you all right there, Colonel Cake? Are you coming back to us? Yeah, yeah. It's, I just tried to get my yoke back working, so I'm flying autopilot at the moment. <laughs> ah. I'm overweight now. Uh, let's straighten the wing. Uh, flaps up. I should have done that a lot earlier, but I wasn't too sure of the climb rate. And now we're good. Now we've gotten rid of that drag. I can take a right turn over this hill, which is madness. I got a hundred knots. So I got some to spare, so we're golden. Uh, there we go. Happy days. Let's get my autopod sorted out. I'm going to zoom in here. Uh, let's see here, it's on GPS. Uh, you can see the altitude here. I'm going to put that down to 2,000 feet. I'm preferring, climbing really slow here. i got to concentrate there. Uh, vertical speed, although it's probably too late. Hit the VS button. Vertical speed at 700 feet a minute. Uh, I'm going to hit the other pilot button now. Let's get a smooth transition. Let's get 700 feet a minute. Manually first. Uh, there, thereabouts. Come on. Oh god, it's not over shot. What about it on? That'll do. What about it on? Reasonably smooth ish kind of transition. <laughs> there we go. That was brilliant airfield, Colonel Kink. That was fun. Yeah, uh, I think. I think I have a serious problem with my yoke. Oh no. Well, what if you restart your system? I don't wanna. I know. It, 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 see, it would be at that, that point that things go wrong, isn't it? After takeoff. Now, folks. Uh, did you reconfigure it in the operating system? You know the way you can calibrate it in the operating system? Yeah, no, it's like it, um, it just disables the uh, um, the function, like, you know, which is a pain in the neck. Mm. Hang on a second. Okay, well, you're sorting that out. I'm going to talk about this button box. So, I'm going to talk about the button box, folks. So, I'm going to disable the cameras to get my amazing face out of the way and the controls out of the way. And get my drink. Get my drink. Change the view. There we go. Oh. Oh dear. Okay, so. Um, let me get the website up here, folks. This is one of our. Uh, let's see, and got TNT. Right. So, background story. Uh, initially, I wanted some more rotary dials for the um, the heading of the track. Um, you know, because it's just a pain. Uh, and what I really wanted, and it's my own fault, what I really wanted was this. I spent four hundred. Let me get my face back here so you can see my my uh, my expression. I spent four hundred quid, and this is what I really wanted. Now, okay, look, the real sim gear is great. It looks like the real thing and, and all that kind of stuff. But this is what I wanted. So this is from uh, Got TNT, and you know, I heard about this button box see I've always been saying box of buttons but I don't know if it's the same person I think it is but this is one of ours folks this is uh, this is Ian right 
Uh, now, Ian, if you're on the chat there, you know, let me know. Uh, I, anyway, uh, he's making these himself. Right, and this looks really cool. He's se he's sending one out to me. He's sending something out to me. Now I'm gonna send it back to him. I'm not gonna keep it because that you know we all support each other here in flight sim, don't we? So uh, I'm going to do a video on whatever he sent me, um, and I'm gonna play with it. It looks solid. That looks like metal. It looks pretty cool. Um, you know. So I do remember him saying, "This is what happens when you're indoors with the COVID." So this is the one that, that I, I find very interesting. Okay. Uh, and he's selling it on eBay. Right. Uh, let's go back to the other stuff he has. So this is 29 quid. 29 pounds. 29 pounds. Uh, the other thing I like a lot. I used to love playing and haven't played for ages. I used to love playing Elite Dangerous. And he's got one for Elite Dangerous. I think. Where is it? Where is it? I think that's the same. Eighty-four pounds. Uh, and that is something really cool. Uh, for, you know. And, and this is bespoke. He's making them himself. This looks like it's been done on a printer. So there's loads of stuff here. So. I put the link in. I put the link in the description for that page he has. Tell me if you're on the chat there. Oh, it's the wrong link. Sammy. Hang on. It's the wrong link. Boom. Okay, maybe I've gone too far, Ian. Is it? Here? Or is it here? Which one is it? <laughs> anyway, uh, there's a video coming up on that. Uh, four rotary dials. Isn't it? Wrong link. Okay, Ian says it's a wrong link. But look, uh, I've seen maybe one of those. I pointed, I, I clicked on the wrong, the wrong clicker. Um, so I made a mistake there, folks. With regards to uh, the link. Uh, I tell you what, Ian, send me the link. Send me the link there again on email. Uh, I clicked on your link that you sent me. Is it the button box? Anyway, look, I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll discuss it with Ian during the week. But anyway, he's got cool stuff there that he's made himself. But that's it. Anyway, look, I won't go into all of them. Uh, is it this one here as well? It's this one here. It's all the top. Or it's this one. Is that it? It's the colourful ones, Ian? I want to be careful here because I'm not too sure. But anyway. Right. Um, he's got the dials on here. I'll have to confirm with them. I, I'll get them on. I'll get it. These are even... Is that it, Ian? Let me know. Just say that's it again. Is it the ones with the colours on it? Uh, but look, I'll discuss it with him anyway. He's making them himself, right? And it's got the rotary dials on them. Uh, you know, it looks pretty dark. That looks really cool if that's the right one. But anyway, I'll be making a video on this, guys, right? So, uh, Ian's making them on his own. And I'm gonna do, I haven't done a video for a while on hardware, so I'm going to do the video. Uh, proper, so I don't lead you the, uh, astray. I won't put any links on yet because I'm, I'm not 100 percent sure. I made a mistake there earlier on, but anyway, yes, buttons and switches. What I'm saying is the moral of the story is you can spend an absolute fortune or something. Uh, you know, I've, I may have found a place where you can get buttons, you know, and switches for any flight sim you want. That's all I'm saying. So I, I haven't planned this or anything like that. I just came on randomly. <laughs> there you go. It's coming. Uh, it's coming. Now, where the mother of God am I? Well, I'm, I'm, I'm just on um, trying to land on the next airfield here. Oh, MIG, MG. Uh, is this? Oh, 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 here we are. Okay, I'm, I'm turning on to final. Good timing. 
good timing. So, uh, there it is. I'm going overhead. Oh, it was all planned. Yeah. I'm going to go overhead for a left downwind. So, parks coming back. Let's get my camera back here for the controls. So, I'm going to land this uh, thing like a warthog because. I had to change my control to Warthog. Oh, you're using your your. Oh, cool. Cool. So it's your Satek that was giving you problems. Yeah. I have the Warthog. Uh, I was playing DCS World there a few weeks ago. In VR. I love using the Warthog. Coming down to 100 knots now. Down to 100 knots. Okay, good. Uh, let's get the old Toby going. There's the long way up there. Let's see up there. there. Oh, 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 oh. Let's keep it at a thousand feet, shall we, for the moment on downwind. Not 960. Okay. Oh, let's get I'm kind of far away from the uh, controls. And of course, I'm very, very heavy. I have to change that. Well, you know, the longer the f you fly, the more fuel you burn. Like, you know, so it's. You know, kind of works itself out, doesn't it? Yep. I'm speaking to you. I'm probably going to run out in a minute. But yeah, no, it's like um, the Psychic York decided, no, I don't want to play anymore. I'm thinking that's your excuse. Well, I had to change it to a warthog now. Like, I know it's like, it looks like a Kodiak, but it flies like a warthog now. Ah, <laughs> flying with a stick. <laughs> flying with a stick could be fun. Oh, uh, yeah. It's a side stick. Airbus. Airbus style. Yeah. Well, it's a dad. Like, you know, it's like sort of an Airbus. Go. Here's fixed. Oh, nice long runway. 20 degrees of flaps. 20 degrees of flaps. Trimmy, trimmy, trim, trim. That's fantastic. It looks absolutely fantastic. Just the buildings and everything so clear. Disabling Toby because it's distracting me. Come on, 96 knots. I'm going a little bit too fast. What's going on here? Oh, get on the center line. It's so much easier on the real thing. Got a bit of crosswind, do we now? I think that's gonna fool me. Get on the center line, Robertson. Get on the center line, damn you! I'm floating all the way down the runway, halfway down the runway. This is just. Good stuff. Let's uh, after that horrific landing. Well, it wasn't a horrific landing so much. I, actually, I didn't even get a clap or anything. Uh, so much uh, that it was a long landing. Long landing. Long landing. That's what that was. That's your excuse, and you're sticking with that. That's my excuse. I'm sticking to it. Let's taxi off. This looks like a very neat, tidy. I mean, this is default scenery. Yep. And it looks really cool. But this is in Caledonia, in the middle of nowhere. You'd you wouldn't even know it. You wouldn't even think of it. And they've just done... This. The whole bloody world is mapped. I still can't get over it. I know you're saying, Chilla Cripperson, you've said that a thousand times. You know? It's pretty darn impressive. Let's just park up here. Uh, we're an hour and 19 minutes into it, Colonel Pig. Yeah. Would it be... A wise to take a quick break. I would say we take the break at the next one. Okay, let's do that then. There's a bus coming towards me. Let's see if we can see anyone else coming in. Yeah, I 
Und nix sagt zwei, was ja. steckt uns der? Du kannst da was. Ich bin das Scenery. Uh, this is a place that intrigues me now because I never even thought it existed. And it's a French, kind of French, old French colony. Yeah, is it I still a French I, I, I don't know. I think uh, next year they have a uh, referendum for independence vote or something like that. Wow. I can break off. Yeah, I, 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 use, I use the full runway uh, because I just turn and burn. I'm going to, seeing as I'm so heavy, I'm not going to use the whole runway. And seeing as I have limited fuel uh, and overweight and my rearward center of gravity is uh, beyond limits, I'm going to do everything I can to make it more difficult for myself. I'm going to trip forward though because I know that thing, don't I? Come on. Forward on the props. I can't quite see those, can you? There. Oh, trying to look for two places at once doesn't help. Okay, right. Uh, flaps. Uh, I'm going to take off with no flaps. I think no flaps. Okay, I'm going to take off ten flaps. Probably says that in the book. Okay, ten flaps. And off we go. Full part. Brakes on. Brakes off. Forward a bit. Oh, I, I didn't give myself very much more. made all lots of right rudder required. Lots and lots of right rudder. Trying to get back on the centre line, 50 knots. I should make it fairly at the end, 60 knots now. Pulling back very gently. Oh, 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 too much pitch, too much pitch. Too much pitch, too pitchy. Bloody hell, this is pitchy. Okay, we're good, we're good. We're good. Now you take a left turn. Stop around the engines. Let's take a left hand turn. Are you off again, Colonel Clank? Oh, yeah. 86 knots. Let's keep it balanced if I can. Oh, it just wants to turn over. It just wants to flip over. Toby back on. There's the jet coming off, and he's into the sea. Oh no, he's not. He's made it. Oh, oh, has he? Has he though, really? Yeah, it looks like he's okay. Ooh, the man that's ahead. Ooh, those man that's ahead look busy. Okay, let us get the vertical speed first. Vertical speed is already set at a thousand feet a minute. Great, let's get about there and let's activate the autopilot. Or let's get the. Uh, get a smooth transition here. There we go. Put a pad around. Beautiful, smooth transition. Flaps are up. I'm high enough now. And we can only accelerate from here. Oops. I'm there already. Put a pad off. Oh, it's right next over the hill here. Huh? You're there already. Yeah, it's here, folks. Look. It's just there. Just right there. Uh, let's change our altitude to 1500 feet. And let us. Yeah, nice one, Colonel take So, what we're going to do, folks, we're going to take a break when we do landing here. And I'm going to hope to God I make it with the fuel I have. Sure, we will. I'm sure I'd be sensible and fuel it up when I get there for the next leg. And let's hope there's be a place where I can land and save uh, one's life. So the airfield should be over here somewhere. Yes. No, can't see it yet. Let's go 
get rid of the old trophy here. Not on top of us. Auto pod on now. Oh, it's is that it there? Our copper hat is. That is wow. Looks like a racetrack. So we're overhead, slowing down, taking some power back. Let's not climb like a little tip and die. Stalling. Yep, that's it. Looks like a little racetrack. There's everyone going in there now. I'm gonna do a serious dive here to get in. There's everybody going in. Boston Elf, Hulu Logist. Are on final. They're all going in. Ten flaps. Twenty flaps. Twenty flaps. Early turn. When I come back, I can start recording these landing strokes. When we come back, I want about eighty knots now. Maybe seventy-five, actually. Seventy-five knots. Fluttering. I couldn't miss that, could I? Okay, let's do an S turn here and slow down. Stop. Yep. Oh, of course, I'm very heavy, aren't I? That was not wise. I can't turn very well when this is heavy. Stop. Oh, come on. Stop. This is bizarre Stop. when it's heavy. Okay, I'm going around. You can't throw this around when it's heavy, folks. Kicking off. Stop. Oh, it wants Stop. to stall. It Stop. wants to. Stop. What the hell has just happened there? Stop. We are down. That was close. That wasn't the close. We're dead. We are dead, folks. That flew very interestingly. That was just very irresponsible flying, and that's what happens. Full of weight, out of center of gravity, turning too steeply, and I noticed. You see, I had all the flaps down, that's why. That is why. Let's try that again now and see if I can get out of that. Uh, do you want to guess how I can get out of that mistake there? That's dangerous because the flaps were down. So I was right here. This is going to drop out of the sky now, so I have to fix that. Please be just the buttons. Some producer buttons kicks off the minute something goes wrong. Let's see if we can replicate that and get out of it this time. Yeah, let's get the flaps up. Buttons freaking out. Just buttons, please. <laughs> just buttons, please. Please, just the buttons. Okay, this is a tricky one. Uh, flaps are up now. It's flying, even though it's incredibly heavy, it's flying a little bit better. It's flying a little bit better. <laughs> That's flaps down. You can't just throw it around. There we go. Now, it's much easier with the flaps down, see? Now all the flaps are coming down on final. Put them all down at once. Side slipping. I'm doing everything wrong. This is also dangerous. This is because it's flip over. Because I've got the flaps down. And the producer buttons is not pleased. And the producer buttons is very displeased. This one's pleased. This one's. This is just a buttons. This looks going to be such a bad. Just a buttons are next. Just a buttons. So got nose it's three times. I'm gonna stall again. I can't get the nose down because my rear center gravity and I was going too slow and I've lost authority. And we're dead again. <laughs> this is all your fault, just buttons. Don't look like that. Don't look like that. You know? <laughs> that's that's I know it's my fault really, but just buttons. You know well that's we're gonna to have to have the treatment you come back. So I've crashed again. <laughs> crashed again because I was making making around. Oh. <laughs> okay, you're gonna try it is again. It, and see, there's a difference. Like, I crashed during takeoff because I had mechanical failure. 
you crashed during landing twice because you don't have a clean cockpit there. No, the cockpit is not clean. Producer button's kicking off big time. Producer button's not happy. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's try and save this one now. Producer button, just sit there now politely. Okay? Okay. Alright. Producer button, just sit there. And don't do anything. Uh, where's the robot now? Oh, there it is. Is that I, it there? I think if, if, if Logitech doesn't have a driver update by next week, I'm oh, just button, please. gonna go and burn the yoke and get myself another one. Logitech, yeah. This is going to be the most difficult. This is very difficult. Where's the one we got now? Oh my god, this is terrible. Uh, okay, there's the one. Is that the one Clutter. Uh, let's say this. Just what? Just left the room. Oh, no, she hasn't. There we go. Right, okay, power back. Flaps going down. Oh, flaps are already down. Okay, let's see if we can get this one in. Not too fast now. I'm gonna have to do an orbit. And I'm turning with a high, you know, with a heavy. But if we're with central gravity, if I go too slow, it appears that the nose just goes up and I can't get it down. That's what happened there. Right? So, uh, if I go too slow, that center of gravity seems to take off the rear with center of gravity. So, I'm going to keep it above 85 knots. It's just... It's just not... It's just not... It's just not cricket. Okay, we'll come down a bit here now. halfway down the runway because of the trees. Uh, thank you for keeping away, producer buttons. Everything will go fine now because producer buttons isn't having a, a conniption. It was hard work, wasn't it? No, 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 we didn't. What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, this is hell. <laughs> what are And now, let's enjoy an intermission. We hope you filled your snack bar full of tasty treats to eat and drink. Perhaps a tempty tasting hotting dog, or a thirst quenching sugar drink. Some fresh crunching popping corn perhaps, or an assortment of sugar coated sweetness, even enjoying a sickness stick. We've plenty of time, so visit your snack bar now. Now, Mr. and Mrs. Barker enjoying and gorging on the lovely treats with their lovely children. You could be doing this too, you still have time. And for those of you tea lovers, let's have a look at some tea making tips. 
Yes, the most important tea making tip, of course, when you have time, is to use the right mug. Yes, the right tea mug is always the right way. Look for the Gripersim tea mug. Yes, it makes your tea taste 20% better. No, don't worry, you still have plenty of time to make your cup of tea. Mrs. Ainsley Cretra, what do you think of drinking a cup of tea from the Gripersim mug as opposed to the normal mug? Lovely. It's not everyone who can make a good cup of tea. Splendid, Mrs. Ainsley Crabtree. Now, here are the ladies discussing the six points of making a good cup of tea, and of course, the Gripsin mug will be included. Which number will it be? Can I remember them? Of course you can. Try now. All right, here goes. Number one. Mama, see the Gripsin mug. Always use a good quality tea. Yes, of course. Good. Number two. Always use freshly drawn water, right? Um, number, three. number three, remember to warm the teapot or urn. Everyone knows that one. And number four, measure the right quantity of tea Butter. for the amount of water in the pot. Very good. Number five, the water must reach boiling point, pot to the kettle, not kettle to the pot. And the last rule, number six. Here we go. Let the tea brew for five to ten Damn minutes. Damn your eyes, woman! God bless! With the seventeen mark. Where does it all start? Sometimes here, with an acid stomach. Or here, with tense, upset digestive nerves. It may even reach here, with that fuzzy, achy feeling in the head. Are you suffering from intermission anxiety? It's the acid tension trouble triangle you're suffering from. Yes, now there's a new anti-intermission liquid, Peptis Liquid Elixir. It will break that bothersome intermission trouble triangle. This fast-acting liquid has no need to wait for it to dissolve as it's in liquid form. With unknown ingredients, it will settle acid in your stomach and those nasty intermission blues. Side effect of peptides may include constipation, skin rash or dermatitis, diarrhea, dizziness, drowsiness, dry mouth, severe migraines, insomnia, suicidal thoughts, abnormal heart rhythms, internal bleeding, cancer, loss of sexual appendages, funny walk syndrome, loss of hair, reddening of the hair, big red nose syndrome, whitening of the skin, unusual voice patterns, childish behaviours, a propensity to blow up balloons. Death. Break that intermission trouble triangle with Peptas. Yes, Peptas available somewhere. Just a minute, folks. Yes, that's all it takes to visit our refreshment counter in the lobby. There you'll find popcorn and an assortment of popular candy bars to please every taste. Try one of these delicious candy bars. Big time. Ingredients include chemicals derived from petroleum. Butternut. Preservatives including sodium benzoate and sulfur dioxide. No nuts included. Milkshake. Including wood pulp and duck feathers as fillers. Payday. Including propylene glycol, carcinogenic flavorings, including trace elements of starch, strychnine, and Topped lead. with Hollywood's super rich coating of the kind you like best. They taste wonderful. They're delicious. They're nutritious. Get one at our confection counter in the lobby now. Now. Word from our esteemed producer. <coughs> Such kind words. And now back to our normally scheduled programming. <coughs> okay, <coughs> I have producer buttons under control. Uh, I have producer buttons slightly under control. If you'd stand here, producer buttons, right? Just, just there. Just here. Just here. Sit. Sit there. Wait. Now, producer Buttons has been very upset. Uh, I, I forgot to give her the treat at the beginning. She informs me of the stream. So, producer Buttons have to get, has to get her treat. Uh, so, producer Buttons, say hello to everyone. You ready for your treat? Okay. There you go. There you go, little Buttons. There you go, producer Buttons. So, producer Buttons is now, hopefully, after that, will be appeased from the crazy madness and try to make me crash successfully. Uh, yes. Just the buttons. No, the foolish way, the foolish way would be to take off uh, towards the tree and the hill rather than the clearance, right? That's where I'm facing now. Ah, no, no, you don't. You, 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 you face the non-foolish way. Oh well, then that would be, uh, you know, 
That would not be. <laughs> that would just not be the way. Oh, you should come over to my side. Like you know, that's that's. I'm coming to your side, and I'm not even using the whole runway. Uh, you you you, you probably want to use like at least half of the run. <laughs> Do you think? Okay, well maybe here. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I have yeah. taken a bit of the weight off. In yeah. fact, I've, okay. I've dumped all that weight. Okay. Right? I've dumped all that weight because it's just we're going to crash all the way through the rest of the stream with the rear <laughs> center of gravity and overweight. Okay. So I've done that. I haven't changed the fuel though. So the fuel is imminently going to run out. But, you know. Oh. Let's make sure it doesn't. Okay. What have we got here? Let's have a look. Uh, we have one gallon left. Uh, yeah, you probably want, until we go. You probably want a wee bit more. Well, let's put 12, 12 gallons on here. So we've got two gallons before we go. And let's hope I find a landing spot. You see, normally this happens when you don't realise it. And I shouldn't have done that now because I now know. You know, so I leave it at that. <laughs> uh, I don't know what the unusable fuel. Anyway, we've got... Uh, we'll have an engine failure at some point. All right, so, we, so here... We're gonna go. Yeah. We're not gonna use the whole runway, although we have all the weight off. And let's rock and roll and get my controls in order. Let's just set up the cam there for the controls so you can see what I'm doing. And okay, I'm I'm, I'm right lining everything here now. Let's go. Full power. Feet on the brakes. And then brakes are loose. Oh, this is very dangerous. This is very this is wrong. Oh, I may in trim. I don't know. Okay, so here we are. Okay. Oh, we're not leaving. 50 knots, 60 knots. No, I'm not getting any speed at all. Oh, whoa, whoa, we made it. Oh, not into oh, the tree. there you tree. go. You're not, in front not, of me there, Colonel Fink. Not into knots. the tree. Oh. I've got the brakes on. Hang on, i got the brakes on. I must have the brakes on. Why do you have the brakes on? That would be foolish. Oh, yeah, I had the brakes on. <clears throat> into the trees. That's what happens. Because I didn't do my calculation for takeoff. I would have gone into the trees there. So that was first attempt dead, gone. And I took off with the brakes. I had the engines trying to overpower the brakes. Now, where's the parking brake in this? Let's make sure it's physically disconnected. There it is, so it was there. Now. Okay, brakes are good. Now. Will I make it? I don't know. Full power. Let it speed up. Check my flaps. I'm going to use 10 flaps. See, I've got full brakes to press now, and it's, it still wants to move. Okay, I've got speed now. I've got 30 knots. 40 knots. 50 knots. I'm going to stall it on purpose over the trees. Oh, it's not stalling. Wow. didn't stall. I had like 20%, 20 degrees nose up. Okay. That's the difference it makes when you don't have all the weight. You know? Up. Yeah. That was easy. I I kind of was pretty convinced to myself that I was going to crash into the trees there. So that's the difference the Kodiak will make. <coughs> it's not with, overweight. Uh, it's not overweight. <laughs> and and out of centre of gravity. Right. All of those things. Now it's turning quite well, whereas before I crashed here. Well, it was going a bit slower, wasn't I? Let's get back on profile. Yes, this is a very ex uh, a very exciting stream, uh, Colonel Clink. Yes, it is. Davo says, "What what did I miss? He just had breakfast. Uh, I everything was fine, Davo. We, no no events. We didn't crash or anything. You know." Uh, yeah, he crashed. Overweight, you know, uh, out of center of gravity. I've taken that off now. Uh, I'm, I'm sure nothing bad is going to happen from now on. You know, I'm pretty sure nothing's going to happen bad from now on. And, uh, yeah, everything's fine. Not more than likely. Mother death kill. Yeah. No, oh, we just, sorry, we, we, we just have to go like over the mountains and that sort of stuff like you know but nothing bad is gonna happen <laughs> no nothing bad's gonna happen oh that's my controller 
buttons here. <clears throat> this is going to be a really difficult stream here. Right, the juice of buttons is... is are you alright there? Alright. Everything, everything fine? Oh, it's going better. Oh. Looks like producer buttons, please don't go into the cables. I better climb here and, and get the camera work done at the same time. Vertical speed. Oh, I'm going to fix my altitude here. Uh, vertical speed. Increase. Come up. On vertical speed. Oh, we're getting, uh, we're getting into a spot of trouble here. There we go. Getting into a spot of trouble. Uh, just want to keep you appraised of what's happening with producer buttons. Uh, producer buttons is probably a little bit upset with regards to <laughs> the mountain flying, perhaps. Let's see if she settles down. No. No. It's getting worse now. Uh, let's zoom in here on the troubles that, that are happening. Uh, things and stuff are happening. Oh dear. I seem to be in a spot of bother. Um, I seem to be in a spot of bother here. With some hillage. Uh, Autopilot off. I've got full power. I've got oh, I've got loads of nuts to get over this hill. I've gone off track entirely. I think the sim, uh, the autopilot couldn't get on track, so I was going around in circles there. Uh, but just buttons are still going. No, I'm still at it. Yeah. Now. Let's zoom in a little bit. Sorry, folks, uh, for those of you who are actually physically following me. <laughs> in the simulator there. Um, just a few snags. Uh, a few technical hitches. Oh, God. Oh, I see what you've done. You've gotten in the valley. Okay, great. Now, going to the valley. No, you have to get to a safe altitude at some stage. Yeah, I'm trying to find this valley here. I got, there we are. So I found the valley. Uh, I just want to get the autopilot sorted out. Autopilot on. Uh, it just you know the way sometimes the autopilot goes in circles. Yeah. Uh, the indication of the uh, buttons meter is showing everything should be fine. <laughs> I hope. No, I ain't following. So you can't turn sharp enough for all the waypoints. Although it's kind of they're going, they're kind of. Let me go again. Uh, I gotta make it over here. Let's try and put the autopilot here to get over the hills. No, it won't do the vertical speed. So let's take the autopilot off and let's get over this hill. I've got. Oh, maybe 14 knots before I stall. I'm in a death valley. I'm in a death valley now. Uh, 80 knots. Oh god, this is not very good at all. Oh, we're barely making it over the hill. Okay, we're over the hill. Oh, wow. Very dangerous. Very dangerous flying in flight simulator. Well, not in flight simulator, but... We'll be in the real world. Button, I repeat, buttons has ca producer buttons has calmed down. I repeat, producer buttons has calmed down. Stand down from emergency. Uh, let's just get that. There we go. A little bit of an intercept. And we're golden. Now we're on our way. Run away. Autopilot on. 
let's make our altitude 3,700 feet. There, we're good. Start accelerating from here. And I'm amazed I hadn't run out of fuel with it with that uh, with that issue. But all that messing about, I'm amazed I didn't run out of fuel. Let's have a look at our fuel situation. Yeah, pretty dire. Pretty dire. Uh, so yeah, let's. I'm not going to change altitude. <coughs> More altitude. Come on. Altitude select. Now, let's see if we can make it to the next waypoint. Ooh, another, another valley here. I think we have two more airfields to go, or is it just the one? Oh, we better get moving. We've got a long way to go. We've got two more, am I right, Karen Clink? Uh, there's this one, and then there is one more on the last one. Yeah, so we're going to come around to the... To the west. Uh, east. Sorry, to the east. But there's one in the east. I think I can see it. Uh, and then there's a final one in the west, I think. Oh, no, there's two more. Okay. Getting bumpy now, folks. It's getting bumpy. Let's have a look at the comments. We've got a bit to go. Let's have YouTube first. Plasma Dave saying lots of waypoints points coming up. There is. So if you want to fly in the valley, you know, uh, I think I'm going too fast to keep up with those waypoints. Because it's going in big, kind of big, slow turns. Yeah. Well, the waypoints are there to navigate the valley, but you can't, like, if you're going full tilt, like, you know, you won't make them. No. Yeah, I won't make them. You have to be going very slow, look. <clears throat> uh, we've got quite a ways to go yet. See, it's turning left there now, and I'm at the, I'm at the runway. So let's disconnect the autopilot. Let's slow down. Let's start losing a bit of altitude. The runway is just down here somewhere. There it is. There's the runway. I'm going to take a right turn for a left downwind. And let's avoid my TV from switching off for power saving. You just hate the way the television wants to turn off. Those bops. <coughs> no word of the PMDG though. Or the um, ATR. So waiting for those. Second. Oh, it's way out of bounds. There is another one. Let's get my camera set up. Have I got it set up? I do. stage of flaps. It's going to be a tight one. It's going to be tight. Find the flaps. Let's aim for 80 knots. And should be, should be trim trim. Five knots, if I can get it. All the flaps are down, gears fixed. 
I hate approaching from the side, but what are you going to do? Let's, get this, let's start a rush along here now. There go. There we go. Let's not float all the way down. It's got a nice smooth landing. A nice smooth landing for once. What a buttery smooth landing. Yay! A buttery smooth landing for Gripper Sim. A bit of reverse boost. So here we are, short flying on. Oh, let's see if I can get out here. Let's see if I can get out of your way. And let's see if we can get out of the cockpit time to... Are you on short final there? Back back on. Outside. Short next view. Oh, I missed you. No, no, no. Are oh, you still not final? Yeah, yeah. You're over the threshold. Here comes Colonel Clank. Very nice, Colonel Clank. I presume that's you uh, reversing your thrust. Yeah. Excellent. Very nice. I got that nicely. Uh, who else do we have? Mm, any more? No, it doesn't look like it. So, and I think. I think we have to do another take off foolishly into the hills. Yes, I think we do. Yeah, I, I, I think, I think there's, there's no other way. Let's backtrack. There is no other way, but it's very, uh, it's really very good in the simulator, at least short field takeoff. Yeah. You know? Um, I see you're backtracking all the way. You know, I see you're backtracking all the way to the end of the runway. Yeah, but it's like I still have all the passengers in here and, um, you know, full of cargo. Well, I'm going to take off with like a quarter of the runway remaining. <laughs> okay. Yeah. A uh, few could run out at any minute. Oh, yeah. So will, will, we, will we get moving? I, I, I think we shall, yeah. Let us go forth. I've got 10 flaps. Full power. Full power, 20 flaps. Full power. Uh, off we go. Uh, I've got 30 knots already. 40 knots. Bobbing around, 50 knots. 60 knots. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Off we go. There we are. Off we go. Easy. Following the valley. One stage of flaps coming up. Pops up. Power. Uh, lots of power. I like this. All flaps up. Uh, I'm over. Extend the power there. Second bit of power back. There we go. Angie's uh, back below 100%. And turning to get the next waypoint. Hopefully, it'll pick up the waypoints. I've skipped a few. Actually, hmm. no, we're heading now. We're heading now uh, westward, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Okay, I've got it going nicely. It wants me to go back the other way, but I'm not going to do that. I'm going to uh, set the autopilot to heading. I will fix that as we go. Uh, boom. at the vertical speed. And all the pilot on. <coughs> now, uh, what I need to do, folks, right? If I put the autopilot on now, it's going to go back the whole way to the airfield. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go direct to... What's that waypoint there? USR 78 direct uh, to USR 72. Now, if I click this, I can type it. Move the arrow keys, and I can't. USR 72. Hit direct. Activate it twice. Hit enter twice. Enter, enter. 
No. Oh, sorry, USR-78. Damn it. Correct. Click. Come on, click it. USR-78. What the deuce happened there, folks? Better do this before I hit that hill. You. You. What? Hills now. Enter, enter. Done. And done before the hills. Switch you to nav. Vertical speed. Oh no, 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 not vertical speed. Altitude select. Got a 4,100 feet. Vertical speed. Set. And up we go. Just in time. Um, it's nice to be able to use the autopilot quickly. Be fluent with it. You know? Oh no, that's not going to happen, is it? I'm not going to make it. Am I going to make that? Maybe, maybe. Oh, yeah, I'm going to make it. I'm going to make it over the hill. Uh, the wheels may just touch the top of the hill. Oh, you can see the grass blades and everything there, folks. We may need to go even a little bit higher now. So I'm going to change my altitude now to 4,500 feet. Uh, and get a little bit higher. Right. Let's get rid of the... Let's make the controls a little bit smaller here. It's taking up too much space. Uh, move my face here a little bit out of the way. If I can, if let me. And we are on... I think it's our... We've got two more airfields after this. I'm going at full kilt. How are you getting on, Colonel Cake? Uh, not too bad. Let's have a look at our YouTube comments. Uh, HD34 Aviation says, for Colonel Clink, you shouldn't need drivers for the Satec yoke and throttle. Use internal windows plug and play for years. He's used it. Oh, I've run out of fuel. Uh, I've run out of fuel. Uh, <coughs> that's a surprise. Not the best area in the world to run out of fuel, is it? Uh, is there a road somewhere? Oh god, where's the stream going here? Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to use my mouse. I need a road. Um, yeah. Oh. Okay, I'm going to choose that spot there as a potential landing spot. Uh, yeah, this area here, folks. I'm on a left downwind. Uh, I'm gonna land it there. Very dodgy. There's no road down there. We're in the jungle here. So uh, let's aim for the center of that area. Let's not lose sight of it either. This is the problem with flight simulator, unless you're flying with VR. If I lose the center of that, that area there, I don't wanna be too high either. So uh, you can s you know, check how the engine failed. Where is it? Oh, no. Problem is, if you can't keep your eyes on it, it's all over. And I can't do that with the sim. Where is that place? I can't see it. See, I've lost sight of my landing spot, the most dangerous thing you can do. Uh, okay, that's gone. That's 
the worst thing you can do and I can't I can't keep my eye on stuff now I've got to replan this and find somewhere else uh, if I had VR on that would that would have been easy uh, I'm hoping there's a little gap at the end of this valley this is all very stressful sorry Karen, I think this must this might delay us a little bit Get that glide speed here. Um, yeah, this isn't looking good, Colonel Pink. This ain't looking good at all. Well, we're in trouble. Oh, good God, come on. Oh, for God's sake, I haven't got time for this now. I'm trying to do the, the you know, on your, my landing checks, but it's not going to happen. No time for that. Uh, let's see what's over this valley here. No, that's all. looking for this is a good great glider this aircraft i'm just flying down the valley here is that a gravel oh is that a gravel is that area there ahead is this area here looks like maybe it's a little bit of an area here not an airfield no okay we're going in there we're going in there if i make this if I make this, I'll be quite surprised. Let's set my view set up here a little bit more realistically. I'm not going to run my flaps onto the final mo final moment. Ooh, rain! What's that? Rain. I'm I'm Did in a rain, rain cloud. Yeah, I see nothing. <laughs> okay, I'm going for this gravel bank here. First set of flaps. Definitely going to make it. Second set of flaps. Ooh, and bumpiness. That's such flaps. Happy days. Flaps. Going a little bit too fast, but it's uphill. Alright, let's make it firm landing. Brakes on. Brakes on. Brakes on. Brakes on. Oh, 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 Okay, we're getting through the rain clouds. Whoa, I see the ground again. Happy days. I made it. I made it. That is bizarre. Great celebration here. Producer Buttons is jumping around the room in great excitement uh, with that brilliant you find, simulator. You found yourself a strange place I found to myself, land. I found myself a place to land. Sorry for the choppiness there, guys. I can get rid of that there now. Yep. So what we you do found that for? What? Why did you land there? Because I ran out of fuel. Uh, again? Jesus. Yeah. I ran out of fuel. But we, we're alive. Uh, we're all good. So i got loads of fuel now. <laughs> they came out of the rainforest. Uh, I'm going to take off here again and rejoin you, Colonel Clink. Uh, I know uh, it delayed things a little bit. I'm sorry for that. Um... Flaps up. Okay. Um, in the cockpit. I didn't pay attention, but I'm in the rain cloud here. I'm somewhere right over the airfield. And I see absolutely nothing. Are the Bing Bing? We haven't had many Bing Bings today. That's Kieran. Kieran, what to see. Kieran, greetings. And Captain Sim earlier on, you followed as well. And by the way, I didn't get a Bing Bing. Nemo Trex, sorry Nemo Trex, you subscribed there. Uh, thank you, Nemo Trex. Uh, and uh, Ake Ins followed as well. And yeah, thank you, Kieran, and thank you, Captain, and thank you, uh, Nemo, Nemo Trex. And someone there. 
Okay, I made it below the rain clouds. Uh, I back, see something. Back and, um... Okay. Flaps up. Turn flaps. Foot apart. Off we go. We're going for it. We're getting out of here. Parking brake off. Let's see if we can take off from here. current click. Sorry for the delay. Okay. We're going straight to uh, straight to your full power. Okay, it's a uh, it's a long air period. Okay. What I'm going to do, folks, is because that was a little bit of a delay, I'm going to use the the cheat key. Would you mind if I use the cheat key to get to your current click? Yes. Oh, you would mind? Okay, I thought oh, you yeah, were in a rush. Oh, yeah, because you're flying this real vessel. You, you, you're missing the surprise. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I go direct to the airfield, so. I go direct to the airfield. Switch to heading mode. On the... Not it. Boom. I want to make sure I'm climbing at a good rate. Do there. Attitude set. Autopilot is now on. Nice transition. I would prefer a little bit of a better climb. On. Climb, damn you. Climb more. There we go. 500. Okay, it's not going to make it all that hell. Good. Hold upon it back on. Oh, yes, there is some cloud at your head. There is indeed some cloud at your head. Don't want to deprive you of. Let's get some eye candy uh, views here, folks. Let's get rid of my mug. And controls. And get free up that real estate for some eye candy. So I'm pleased about that simulated force landing. Uh, I didn't do any checks, but... You know, I, I couldn't move my hands around the cockpit. Yeah, I'm in the clouds. It's, it's cloudy each time. Yeah, we're in we're in the uh, we're in the stuff now. Okay, let's get navigating here. So, uh, oh, I just by haps I'm going directly towards the airfield. I'm going to hit the direct button here. Try this again. November. Whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. No, that's not what I want. Go away. November. No. What do I click this in here? Oh, it's this thing here. I November. Whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. Oh, that's the keyboard there. Okay. Great. Okay, I, I think I figured something new out here. Activate, activate. I'll hit the enter button twice. There we go. Let's take the end one back a bit. I'm 102%, which is going to destroy the engine. And all of, uh, now on. Oh, you have made this very interesting. Now it's on. Let's slow down a bit. Yes. Um, I can't see a thing. Let us descend. The no, and I don't even have the um, I 
I don't even have the, uh, you know. Okay, I'm right over the airfield. I, I can see nothing. Hmm? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Let us zoom in, so at least I got some orientation. Okay, so it's low around here. I know there's no mountains around here. So I'm going to do some circling and come down. All the pilots off. See some orbits. Now what you're going to do, oh yes, yes, I'm out of it now. You know, if you know you're at sea, if the sea is there, you can go over the sea and kind of, I know this is very, you know, it's not what I want to do in real life. If you, you go over the sea and just descend until 500 feet, and if you can't see it, and then, well, then, you know, kind of stuffed. So I've come out of the clouds. And we're coming around. It's a big airfield. There it is. Easy. I love the way the weather changes. I want a bigger monitor. <laughs> it's just so atmospheric. I'm going to throw it in here. I'll get the camera back now shortly after we land it. First stage of flaps down. Second stage of flaps. Full flaps. I'm on a very tight base for a left base for one way. It looks like two nines. Right, I'm down. I didn't really take my time with that landing, did I? Because I know we're falling behind time. You ready to go, current click? Okay. Let's go again, folks. Full power. I swear the last landing I'll make it an ace, okay? Rolling. I know you've been waiting for me, so I'm I'm kind of trying to catch up here. So up we go. That was for the full flaps. <laughs> there we go. Flaps are coming up now. We're still climbing. That's fine. All flaps up now. Right. Okay. So uh, nav uh, altitude is set. Gonna put our altitude to 2,000 feet. And autopilot's on. I'm at 550 feet, 600 feet a minute. And let's get some eye candy and the cameras back. We don't need that for now. Just the scenery with the, the change of weather, I just can't get it. It's a sprint. So, so cool. 
Is everyone behind taking off? Last leg, folks. Last leg. Uh, I see. Look at all those lights behind. How cool is that? Now I can pay attention to the comments. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to crash into anything. Uh, where am I turning here? Where am I going? Where is one going? Okay, that's fine. We're going straight over the uh, straight over the sea. I'll take a bit of power back here, just a wee bit. I'm bombing along. <laughs> okay, so uh, we have. Let's have a look at the YouTube comments first. Uh, M M Microsoft Flight Simulator hanging says, what's she doing? Ha ha. Well, she's actually calmed down now. Uh, Microsoft Flight Simulator hanger. Let's get the camera working again here. Eh, da, 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 da. Camera button, please. There we go. Yeah, she's... Once the treat has been disposed of, you know, Jesus Button's work is done. How can you get mad at that face? You know, how can you get mad at that face? I mean, look at it. You can get mad at that face. So she's quite pleased with herself. Uh, we seem to have lost current clink. I think you may have control issues again. No, no, no. He's Where's still here. Look at that scenery. Looks uh, fantastic, doesn't it? It's just stunning. <clears throat> just the change into the I, I know I keep saying it it's, a, it's, just the, it's the weather and we're going over the sea so not a long trip over the sea but that weather's behind us now you can see all the lights behind uh, let's have another look at the comments here again and see what people are saying Yes, Ling, we need to, you need to chip in for uh, a, a paint job for my aircraft. Uh, oh, Colonel Pink, did you know it was over there at some point? Someone's telling me. Huh? Did you know it's over? No. Ah. No, no, it's over. Okay, let's have a Twitch stream. Comments here, I missed a few. First time chat from a viewer. Oh no, that's that's. Uh, I have to get rid of this guy. Uh, how do I do that? Uh, boom. And how to get rid of that? Uh, I just got some nonsense there. That's not what I wanted to have happen. Sorry, folks. I'm just trying to get rid of the computer. Okay, look. Let's ignore it. Well, I can't get rid of the damn um, thing on the screen. Uh, I got some nonsense text there. Okay. I don't have to ban them from here. Okay, I have to figure that out. Anyway, uh, Davo, uh, I keep overshotting. 
Overshooting. Yes, I do. I'm, I'm flying like a reckless madman today. I'm, I must be in a slightly odd mood. Uh, it is Sunday after all. It is a crazy stream. Uh, and Karen, 1976, says, ah, look at the beauty of that producer buttons. Yes, producer, <laughs> producer buttons is very cute there, folks. Look at the face. Aww. Look. Where are you going, Gripper? Flying, uh, flying, mm, Gitty says. Uh, I think that was from earlier on. I was going all over the shop, wasn't I? Because I couldn't find the airfield. Uh, I hit the direct button, all that kind of stuff, so it was a bit messy, I understand. Because you're probably following me when you're flying along after the engine failure. Uh, what else have we got here? Get rid of that. Can I get rid of those? See, what happens sometimes, you get spammed, you know. You know, buy followers, primes, and viewers, and I can't get rid of it. Uh, that was three. Yeah, don't click on that one. It's not going to do any harm to you, but it's just annoying. Uh, I mean, just now we've all landed. Uh, we're going to the last waypoint, which is. So am I going the right way? Let's check. Let find the cockpit. Oh, I've gone off my nav. Have I? I'm going the wrong way, Karen Clink. You went the wrong way. Oh shit, I was at the, at the last. Are you sitting there waiting for me at the airport? I'm, I'm just about to land, you know. Uh, November Whiskey Delta, uh, sorry, no, November Whiskey Bravo Oscar. Uh, something like that. Yeah, sorry folks, I actually thought, I thought there was another waypoint. Another waypoint? It's um, November, November Whiskey Bravo Oscar, yeah. Yeah, I just took off. I thought there was another one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going out to sea. Uh, I've gone. I've gone mad. Right. Uh, let's turn around. Zoop. And someone does a bing bing. <laughs> I thought there was another one, folks. I thought there was one more, and I just landed and took off straight away. Uh, I hit the autopilot button and off we went. So let's just figure my head out here. Uh, that, that, that I was going to show you the... Uh, where is it? Sorry. All right, all right, all right. Let's see the window. Let's see the window. Where is the flight plan gone? There's the flight plan. Yeah, see, i tell you what I did wrong here, stupidly. Not that it matters. Uh, I thought... No, that's not what I want at all. The worst stream ever. I thought we were going to here. Let me just zoom in a bit here now. I thought we were going across to this island, you see. On the flight plan, it, it goes to that island over the cross that way. So, obviously not. So, uh, yeah, look. That's, that's what I'm saying. Uh, okay, let's get that landing in. You're all there sitting waiting for me. Okay, let's record this landing instead of making a nice one. Let's hop at the cockpit here for a moment. I can't. Where is it? Okay, we're going a bit past it. Okay, I made a, a narrow judgment there. around here somewhere. Okay, I'm not above it. Sorry about that, folks. That was a real brain fart there. Okay, I'm just right overhead now. Let's get outside and take the autopilot off. Put my eyes on the runway. Nobody's judging you. Oh, I've been judging out to hell. There's everyone there waiting for me because I went off on a tangent and thought there was another leg. Oh yeah, I went right over it, did I? I went right over the airfield because I was busy talking nonsense. There's everyone waiting for me there, look. Hey, nobody's watching you. 
Uh, we all sitting here having a cup of tea. Last one's a grass airfield, obviously. And we'll start to slow down. Wow. <laughs> it's been a long day. Uh, but that's no excuse. So when you're fiddling with the cameras and stuff, you kind of get distracted. There was me showing pictures. Oh, look at that face. It's producing buttons and talking shite. And, um, yeah, that's what happened. I talked shite too much. I'm going to do another orbit here. Clear it up. Oh, it's a nice little grass airfield there, kind of think. I'm recording this landing, so I better make it a good one. As I said, the last one's going to be a real smoothie. Yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll wait and see. We'll see. 100 knots. Let's combine to maybe 80. There we go. Like it looks like Grip has him switched his transponder off. Yeah, I certainly did. No, <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, no, that's not good. I'm going too fast. I said I want to make. I'm going to do another orbit. Because I did say I wanted to make this a smooth one. Let's switch my camera settings here. I've got all the cameras in the right place. I have all the cameras in the right place. Let's get my controls in order here. Uh, let's change the camera over here to my controls. Not that it matters, but look at it. It is what it is. Again, too much. Yes, I have. Oh, look. <laughs> I'm trying to do the cameras. So you see me doing orbits, you're probably wondering why. Uh, I just need to get a little bit of space between me and the runway. I've got shitloads of power in, wasting fuel. Nah, that would be a bit better. I just need a bit of a run at it because this is going to be recorded. Set there, good. Can swing her around. Danger of stalling now. There we go. Five hundred. Like it like a lunatic. Eighty knots. Now I'm where I want to be. Thank you for the flashes, folks. No. No. Not such a good landing. I get a chance folks I'll do an Airbus a random stream this week I know I keep saying it uh, but things are crazy at the moment uh, now let's stop the recording uh, let's do the replay pause replay come on Bye. give it a second to load <laughs> resume replay It wasn't the best landing in the planet. It was kind of rushed. Well, you see, I wasted time coming in right overhead trying to lose altitude. Not a good thing to be doing full flaps, is it? You know? Did I do one more orbit? I did, and I said, no, I'll do one more orbit. Yeah, I came around one more orbit. It's, oh, it's gone a bit thicky again. Don't do that to me, please. Why is it do that? There we go, that's nice and smooth for you all, folks. Let's get rid of the controls. And let's speed that up a bit. Let's pause the replay. Sorry about this. And I'm very unorganised today, that's for sure. Resume replay. Now I've made my decision to throw it in. I've effectively throwing it in all day today, haven't I? I'm throwing it in. That's what happens when you rush things. Thank you for the flashes. 
Oh, boom. I love the suspension. I love that. Just let's have a look from that angle. Oops. What's that current click? I say it's the cargo button here to turn off on this one. Yeah. Let's have a look at that one more time. Suspension is absolutely stunning. So there we go. Sorry to keep you all so long, folks, waiting for me. Uh, that was silly. Uh, and, you know, uh, it's it's 2321. Uh, oh, not bad, Colonel Clink. We said two and a half hours, didn't we? Yeah. And it's two, uh, two hours 35. I could have kept you out there all night. <laughs> <laughs> Doing crazy stuff on the Sunday stream. Uh, uh, sure. There you go. Oh, another Bing Bing. Let me mention those Bing Bings. Oh, oh. So Skyhawk, uh, there. Sorry, Skyhawk. I didn't. I was so busy there. Uh, Kieran, thank you. I said thank you to Kieran. Skyhawk sixty one resubscribed tier one for seven months. It says keep up the good work. Grip buttons is a real cutie. She is. Uh, Producer buttons is now the star of the show. You know, uh, for sure. So you can say ciao ciao to Producer buttons. So thanks to Producer Buttons. Thanks, Producer Buttons, for, uh, you know, for helping me with my landings earlier on and making me crash. And, uh, you know, and thanks, by the way, to Colonel Clink for the brilliant flight plan once again. Well, know, thank uh, you, Colonel Clink. I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, also, Johnny F73 resubscribed Prime for three months in a row. Uh, that's 12 in total. Johnny F is one of the long time uh, subscribers to the channel. And so is Skyhawk, incidentally. Uh, and there's another one. <laughs> there's another one for Davo. Resubscribe Prime for 13 months. Davo, thank you very much. Thank you for sticking around, guys. And Davo's also a long time subscriber. Uh, thank you very much, guys, for supporting the channel. Uh, speaking of support, one of our one of ours uh, are making uh, making hardware. Uh, for flight sim, so I'm going to kick that off uh, because he supports me, and I'm going to support him. Uh, we all kind of support each other here, don't we, Colonel Clink? Absolutely. Uh, so thank you very much, guys, for subscribing. That's really <laughs> nice of you. That's great. It helps me get get uh, you know uh, that kind of stuff uh, to keep the sim going or the channel going. Uh, hype. Oh, okay, don't worry about that. So, Colonel Clink, I don't want to keep you any up any longer. Yeah. No, it's like uh, I think we can call it a day. Um, today. I hope you all have a good week and I see you next time and I hope to see look at that colour there sorry to, to keep you there for the, look at the purpley colour I love it anyway <laughs> folks uh, hopefully I, I know we keep saying it, I'll be back streaming during the week and, and the videos and all that kind of stuff at some point just things have gone crazy with the Covid and then, then uh, some more as you are well aware and uh, I will see you very very soon and uh, what else can I say? But have a great week. And I'll see you at the other side on Sunday. 2100 hours. See you ciao, next ciao. time. Bye now. I must, I must get a button here so I can get the outro. There, I found it. See you, folks. <laughs>